one morning every month. All right, amigos. This kitchen at Tupelo's Avonlea Assisted Living and Retirement Community becomes a makeshift assembly line where volunteers prepare barbecue plate lunches. We sail to the banks and different doctor's offices and deliver them. This is just one of several ongoing fundraisers Shirley helps organize for Project Hope. That organization provides assistance for local cancer, heart disease, and diabetes patients. Shirley knows firsthand the difference Project Hope can make. Her dad suffered from Alzheimer's while her mother was stricken with cancer. And she had to quit work and she canceled her insurance and Project Hope helped her. So they help pay for her gas, her medicine, and different things. Then, a few years later, Shirley's husband was diagnosed with cancer, and Project Hope was there. After he passed away, Shirley made it her mission to help raise money for the organization. Altogether, we probably raised 80 something thousand dollars. But Shirley, who is activities director at Avonlea, can't do it all alone. She has a team of dedicated volunteers who live at Avonlea. Folks like 82-year-old Lorene Overcash. It's a good, uh, good project, and we don't get to do uh, much at our age, but I like to help out wherever I can. Here at Avonlea, there's a wall of plaques commemorating the fundraising efforts of Shirley and her crew, but the volunteers are not driven by awards and accolades. Instead, they just want to give people hope as they're facing the storms and trials of life. In Tupelo, I'm Allie Martin, WCBI News.